Welcome to Chemistry 1A Basic Techniques. Today we'll be looking at weighing by difference. Let's begin. The equipment that you'll be needing today, starting from left to right, is a lab diary, a pen, a spatula, the substance to be weighed, in this instant potassium hydrogen phthalate, a weigh bottle, a beaker, a funnel, a conical flask, also known as an Erlenmeyer flask, a top pan balance, and an analytical balance. Weighing by difference is an efficient and clean technique. We'll start by using a top pan balance to weigh out the approximate amount of substance needed. Therefore, if your lab diary says to weigh out approximately 4 grams, it does not mean that you need to weigh out exactly 4 grams. It should be closest to 4 as you can get it, plus or minus either way. Turn on your top hand balance and wait for it to stabilise. Once it has, place the empty weigh bottle with the lid on on top of the balance. When you have a stable reading, tear the balance. You are now ready to transfer the substance into the empty weigh bottle. However, it is not good practice to transfer the substance whilst the bottle is on the balance. Therefore, take the bottle off the balance. At this point, you need to estimate what approximately 4 grams could look like. Using a spatula, transfer what you think approximately 4 grams could be into the empty weigh bottle. When you are done, place the lid back on to the substance bottle and weigh the substance just transferred. You will notice that the balance is reading 5.72 grams. We are in excess of what we need and some needs to be taken out. We do not do this whilst it's on the balance. When you're transferring the excess substance out of the weigh bottle, do not place it back into the original substance bottle. Instead, transfer the excess substance into a waste beaker. Now let's reweigh the bottle. It looks like we're still in excess. Let's take a little bit more out. Now let's reweigh it. Four point one three grams. Now that's approximately four grams. If you're happy with this nominal amount, take your weigh bottle with the substance in it a conical flask, a funnel, your lab diary and a pen into the analytical balance room. Make sure that your analytical balance is clean. If it is not, consult your demonstrator for the proper cleaning technique. Ensure all the doors of your balance are closed. Once it is, Tear the balance. When you have a stable reading, gently open up one of the side doors and place your substance into the balance. Gently close the door. Wait for the balance to stabilise and when you have a stable reading, record your result. Make sure that you include all the numbers that you see on the balance. That includes the zeros. When you are done, take the substance out of the balance. Remember to close your side door. Now let's transfer the substance into a conical flask. Transfer the substance into a conical flask via a funnel. Tap the weigh bottle to ensure that you are transferring the maximum amount of substance. 
When you're done, take the funnel of the conical flask. Now let's reweigh the empty bottle. Gently open up one of the side doors and place the empty weigh bottle into the balance. Again, wait for the balance to stabilise and when you have a stable reading, record your result. Remember to include all the zeros and the numbers that you see. When you're done, take the empty weigh bottle out of the balance and close all the doors. Once you have recorded your final result, make sure you take all your belongings out of the analytical balance room. You now have all the information you need to work out how many grams of substance is in the conical flask. We have now reached the end of the demonstration. Thank you for watching.